Hello, in this Pixaflux video tutorial you will learn how to improve this hand drill model by creating a smooth bevel around the hard edges and adding a dirt texture to its concave zones. To create the smooth bevel we'll use the mesh smooth normal node with the new scene and object attributes to define different radii for different objects. To add dirt to the concave zones we'll use a mesh curvature node as a mask for a perline texture. We'll start with this version of the hand drill that uses a perline texture for the body and a UV mesh render for the knob and chuck. The normal map is generated by a perline texture that has converted to a normal image and the roughness and metalness are rendered by UV mesh render nodes. Let's do it. Add a mesh smooth normals node. Set the size to 1024 by 1024 and the radius to 0.5. Add a mix node and let it auto connect to the mesh smooth normal node output. Add a mix normal node on top of the connection between the to normal node and the scene textures node. The mix normal node will mix the normals from the render 3D texture node and the mesh smooth normal nodes. Duplicate the mesh smooth normal node and set the radius to 1. Set scene to hand drill and object the body to render only the body. Connect the output to the mix node. Duplicate the body mesh smooth normal node and set the object to handle to render only the handle. Connect the output to the mix node and connect the mix node to the mix normal node. Let's make some room for the curvature nodes. Add a mesh curvature normal node and set the radius to 5. Add a resize node and connect the concave output to the resize input. Set the size to 1024 by 1024. Connect the resize output to the scene textures all bedo input to visualize the concave zones. To create the dirt add a perline texture node and a render 3D texture node. Set the size to 1024 by 1024. Activate the perline texture and set the color. Add a blend node to blend the hand drill texture with the dirt texture. Connect the dirt texture to the foreground input. Connect the blend output to the scene texture's all bedo input. And connect the resize output to the blend mask input. Now let's add some noise to the dirt texture opacity. Add a perline texture and a render 3D texture node. Set the size to 1024 by 1024. Connect this texture to the albedo input to visualize it. Activate the perline texture and set the frequency to 0.5. Add a blend node to the resize output and connect the texture output to the foreground input. Set the blending mode to multiply. Connect the blend curvature output to the final blend mask and connect its output to the scene textures all bedo. This is how you can create smooth texture bevels and curvature dirt for your models using Pixaflux. Thank you for watching this Pixaflux video tutorial. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, or follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Google+.